Welcome back, everyone. This is Super Star Brother playing The Legend of Zelda a Link Between Worlds. <clears throat> well, let's see. We have uh, defeated Yuga. We have uh, told Osphala, or not Osphala, but uh, Sahasra Lassa Lassa Sasa, somebody or other, what was going on. And that uh, we found the castle in this state. Princess Zelda fortunately has given us the Pendant of Courage so that we can go get the Master Sword. To get the Master Sword, we're going to need to go to the uh, two temples and to get the uh, Pendants of Wisdom and uh, Power, assuming. So, to do that, I'm going to have to go get some equipment. Because we cannot enter those temples without the proper equipment. And where else are we going to get it but old Ravio in our house? He's uh, who has moved in. Made himself at home. Hey, welcome back, little hero. Howdy. What happened, buddy? My bracelet did what now? It, uh, it, uh, popped me out of the wall. Huh, who knew? Pretty neat that you can turn into a painting. Wowie, wow, I wish I was you. <laughs> okay. Uh -huh. I wonder if I can steal that power from this weird Yuga guy, too. <laughs> I probably wouldn't try it. No, what am I thinking? I'm not cut out for that sort of stuff. I'd probably screw it all up somehow and get stuck in some dungeon wall. Eee. Okay, yeah, I'll just leave that one alone. I couldn't bear it stuck there forever and ever. Oh yeah, I should leave that kind of tough work to heroes, for sure. Okay. Guess he's not gonna give us what we need first. So we can go and... Oh, hello. Yoo-hoo! Golly! It's time to come home! He must not be able to hear me. Oh, I hope he hasn't gotten himself lost in those woods down south. Down south? Me either. Well, she said south. Maybe we can find him and go south. <laughs> Die, blobber. Die, crow. What woods? There didn't seem to be anything woodsy about this place. Okay, this is a new addition. We've got some glittering rocks that actually have rupees inside. You just strike them like that, and out they pop. Go away, crow. I'm busy. Alright, what we need to do now... Ow! Besides getting poked. I'm gonna whack him. Said south, he's, she said south, she said south. Here we go, let's see if we can find those woods she was talking about. I don't know. Or maybe we should just go to the temple. Oh, I, uh, I'm out of here. Those arrows travel far. Let's see now, we don't want to go that way, because, let's see. There's really no way to get through there. This, I believe, is a uh, Great Fairy's Fountain. Or maybe it's just plain old cave, who knows. I'm going to have to bring it, pull up some light. Give me a moment. Yup, light. Oh, hello. Oh, we can make a treasure box appear if we do this. And I believe it just has rupees. Ropes. It's a purple rupee! How about that? It's 50 rupees. That, don't you sneak up behind me. That is not nice. Okay, let's uh. Da -da 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 -da. I like the way those <laughs> eyes bulge. Oh, hi. Alright, these guys, or er, these guys, I say. The reason I say these guys is because we actually have... Yeah, there's something that is suspicious about that one. Uh, no, I'm not going to do it. Yep, we have the ruby likes. Those annoying little things. I like to pretend that they're innocent. Innocent rupees and lure you in and then suck you up and eat all your stuff. It ain't taking me that easily. Oh, sir. 
So these guys, as, as they did in Link to the Past, they will they will scurry sideways and they will, owie, Franken, ow. Let's see, where am I headed? Mm -hmm. Dum -dum. Hello, it's a bottle, but we're not gonna be able to get it because we can't swim. Hot swim. Well, let's see. I'm gonna see what's in this cave. I am not going to see what's in that cave because I don't have anything to get that fire. Yeah, let's see if we can find that temple. We need to get to that temple. Ow! That kind of hurt, you know. That also kind of hurt. Yeah, let's get to that temple. I think we need to get to that temple. It's Alright, to get to that temple, I'm dodging past all these rupees. I wasn't even really paying attention, but... Oh, wait, I need to go up. There we go, wait. Good thing he's not using a shield. Hmm. Kerbluey. Well, I'm sorry I didn't find him anywhere down there. Let's we'll just go down this way. Hold on. Give me a moment. Yep, there we go. Let's see if we can buy anything from this guy. Looks like he sells shields. And some strange looking fruit. They are actually fruit. That's 50 rupees. Want it or, want it or not? Yeah, I'll get it. So we got the shield. Praise and hold. Press and hold R to raise it. Did I say praise? <laughs> Thanks. Yeah, you're welcome. Oh, I probably should, uh, probably should look at the, uh, fruit he's got. One of them, I believe, is a stink fruit, which will scatter enemies that surrounded you. And another one is a, I'm not quite sure what it is, I can't remember. That thing's 30 rupees. Want it? Uh, foul fruit. A seriously sour fruit. One bite will make you squeal so loud you can stun nearby enemies. Hmm. 30 rupees for that. Nah, I'm not gonna buy it. Come on, buy something. Man, you've got a cheerful disposition, don't you? Okay, this one is a scoop fruit, a mysterious fruit that takes you to a dungeon's entrance, essential for any adventurer. Really? Come on, buy something. Nah, fine, I'll get one of these. So we'll buy one of these. We got a foul fruit! Try using it if you get surrounded by monsters. I don't think I ever used it before. Alright, so I guess our first dungeon will be over this direction, on across this bridge. And I think you can fall in, so don't, so don't do it. Hey there, how's it going? And stretch. Hey guy, you seem like you get around a lot. Don't forget to do your stretches, okay? All right. What? It's not your stretches that you're trouble that are troubling you? Then it must be that building over there, right? What building? Huh? What do you mean, which one? The one with the windmill. You can see it if you use the directional button, the D-pad. The something or other, yeah, like I said, you can do that. So we can see that there is a, uh, he called it a windmill. God, burn it! Arg. So if we see that over there, I think he might give us some more information about how to get there, exactly. Right? Is that right? Now you saw it, right? That building with the windmill? Yeah, I saw it. There's no way to get to that windmill place by land. So that's why I learned how to swim. Now I can get there anytime, as long as I keep up with my stretching. Okay, how do I get there? Huh? You want to learn to swim too? I learned how from the Zoras. Why learn from anyone less than the best? Because they're cheaper. If you want to do the same, head far upstream. Head way in the northeast to Zora's domain. Just don't forget to stretch first. Okay, fine, I'll stretch. Stretch! Yeah. I did my job. Okay, this thing. Hold on, give me a moment. 
Do not enter. Do not blow up wall. Very strange creature inside. Who puts a sign like that on there? Whoa. Whoa! Hold up a second, Greeny! Hey, who are you calling Greeny? Yeah, I'm talking to you! Someone else wearing the green hat? Actually, quite a few people. Who am I? Have I heard of me? I'm Irene, best witch in my generation. Oh. Still a junior witch, but whatever. Alright, get this. I had my fortune told this morning, right? And I was told I'd soon be visited by a disaster. Disaster! Oh. But if I want to change my future, I should take care of Green. I was like, Green? Yeah, me too. What, I should take care of the grass? I'm not mowing every lot in Hyrule! <laughs> She's a witch after my own heart. <laughs> Forget that, I'm a witch on the rise! And then you came along, and then it all made sense. I got to take care of you, Greeny! Okay, that's interesting. So here, take this thing. We got a bell! Now you can call Irene anytime! Been seeing those weather vanes all over the place? Just ring that bell, and I'll fly you to any ones you found. Normally, I don't take passengers, but I'd rather haul you over all over Hyrule than face disaster. I like her. She's practical. Anyway, gotta fly. I have errands to run for my gram. Later. See ya. All right, one more thing. My gram's a world uh, potion brewer. Her shop is behind the Eastern Palace. I strongly suggest you go look her up. Her potions can't be beat. See, I'm looking out for you already, Greeny. Yeah, thanks. Nice to know I got instant transportation. Okay, now where am I going? I'm heading, yeah, northeast. I need to go to Zora's Down, man! So yeah, we can use that bell to call her anytime so that we can uh, teleport to different places wherever there is a... that bird statue. I can... Oh! I, oh I, okay, fine. Nope, I'm not gonna hold my shield. Okay, got it. Gather up the monster. I didn't know they had monster bait. They had monster, not monster guts. Monster guts. Okay, hold on. Yep, there she is. Yeah, let's go ahead and get this. Give this a spin. So now we can teleport here to the witch's house. Save our progress. Progress. And done. Hey, what's your problem? The bridge is broken. Some guy just dashed by and jumped it, though. Me, I could never do that. Yeah, I bet. You don't look like the jumping type. I suppose there's nothing to do but swim to Zora's domain. What'd you say? You can't swim? Hey, just like me. We're like brothers, swimless friend. Wait, you can't swim? And you know what? We both can't get to Zora's domain, either. Oh, really? That's what you think. We can get there by merging into this wall and popping right back out. What a special ability! That's about as special as they come! Huh. Interesting. Thank you. Oh, uh, yeah. Ow! I was gonna hit him! I was gonna hit him! Okay. Oh, crows. Do -do -do -do. This is the way to Zora's domain. That's just what I said. I probably shouldn't have done that. Let's see. Deep water nearby. Stay in the shallows. Well. Whoa, hey. Ow! Youch! Watch where you're going! Hey, you're the one who ran into me. Wait a second. I've seen you. Aren't you that kid who was hanging out in the village? Well, whatever. Out of my way! The queen! The queen! Please help! Somebody help! What's going on? Probably has something to do with that guy that just ran off. Whoa, Nelly! The queen is in a sea of trouble! We've got to do something! But what? The guy, that guy doesn't even know all the trouble he's just caused! Uh, what's going on? What's, what's happening? It's getting worse by the second! I can't believe that guy came in and stole the smooth gem right out from under our gills! That's 
finless jerk probably thought it was just some sparkly thing. But the queen needs it to contain her power. She need what? Without well, that smooth jam, our queen will keep. She needs it to curb her appetite. She'll keep bloating up. But our poor queen. We've got to get that smooth gem back! Or else? Ooh. You must have seen that guy run out with a queen's smooth gem, right? Uh, not with a smooth gem, but I did see a guy run out. We've got to get it back! Stranger, if you see a big gleaming golden gemstone, bring it back here! I'm sure you'd get a nice reward. Ooh, I do like nice rewards. But with that, this is Super Star Brother. To be continued.